Mr. Beast's latest video, $1 versus $1 billion this yacht. This is a $1 billion super yacht. And it's big enough to hold an entire city on the water. How do humans build this stuff? And I'm gonna show you the difference between this and a $300 million mega yacht, a $50 million Jesus. giga yacht, all the way down to this $1 yacht. Why did you sell me this boat for a dollar? The storage is just keep racking up, $18,000. Yeah. So. It costs you 18 grand a year to store this? Correct. Interesting, there you go. Thank you. And after stepping on board, it was pretty clear why this yacht only cost $1. Okay, now that we're on the water. Is it leaking or something? In here. I don't think the floor's supposed to be. It here. actually is. I don't know is. if this is even worth a dollar. Oh, we're actually sinking. Oh. The boat literally started sinking right when we put it in the water. We gotta go up. We're sinking. Oh my John God. Chandler. That was the $1 yacht. Later in this video, we have a $50 million yacht, a $300 million yacht, and the $1 billion super yacht. But before all that, here's the $1 million yacht, which is Damn, a little smaller than dollars. I thought it would be. Hop on, boys. All right. Poor. Let's see the inside. Poor. On the $1 million yacht, you get a surprisingly big living room, a lower deck with a master bedroom, another Damn. bedroom That's that I can't though. stand up in, and then you got some double beds for the kids. Wait, you have kids? Chris. Chandler, Carl, Nolan. Don't worry, boys, I got this. <laughs> Please stop. Someone's gonna send a rescue boat. We need the Coast Guard! I wonder if I turn this if he'll fall. Stop! <laughs> this is fun! Oh! <laughs> For a million dollar boat, I'm not gonna lie, it's a little smaller than I thought. Let's see if these guys watch our videos. Oh my God, he beat their feet. Hey, he has seen our channel, that's pretty funny. So now we're going to the 10 million dollar one. 10 million? Damn. See ya. It's gonna be Bye. great. Bye. Oh my God, he's fast. 10 million. <laughs> and now we are on the 10 that's million nice. dollar yacht. Let's check this out. Holy crap, the front of the boat's huge. This is way bigger than the last one. Uh, Look at the view. I'm getting some good sun here. I'm really pale. Oh my gosh, yes, that this is, nice. is a nice bedroom. For $9 million more, I can actually stand up. And right down these stairs are four more massive bedrooms. Why are there two toilets side by side? Oh, that's a bidet, Jim. For your butt? You poop in here, and yeah. you wash your butt in here. Why don't you just use toilet paper? You're so American. And upstairs is another seating area. Oh my gosh. The seats on the $1 million yacht were leather and hot. These are actually soft. Soft and practical. This boat is the nicest boat I've been on so far. Well, just wait until you see the next one. It's massive. And because it's so massive, I invited all my friends. Go have fun. Go, go, go. Oh shit, wait, is this that This boat is meant to hold 150 people. They're gonna have a lot of fun. Whoa. Oh my God. This is wild. What is the difference between this and a mansion? This is a mansion. When does it stop? Jimmy, I'm still Holy going. Cow. This is definitely the nicest bedroom we've seen so far. And it's nice because my head doesn't cool hit editing. the ceiling. I can barely touch it now. This yacht has a living room, an office, a massage parlor, two dining rooms, and seven bedrooms. Bruh. This is the best yacht I've been on so far. I'm driving the boat. <gasps> Chocolate! It's not feasible. It's not feasible! Thank you for saving my life. You're welcome. No way! You gotta... No! Hey, buddy. Are you relaxed? Yeah, I was. Are you done with your massage yet? Here you go, take a bite. That's some good chocolate. <laughs> so we got all the goon squads in here. It's a $25 million boat with 30 rooms. Why are you guys in here? This bed is so <laughs> cold. Even though this yacht comes with a world-class chef, the boys still wanted pizza. So I planned a little surprise. Do you know what we're standing on, boys? A, a boat. A hospital. An H. A boat. A helipad. An Uber conveniently does helicopter deliveries. That can't be real. Oh, it's real. Is that a helicopter? I can't believe it's actually worked. Dude, this is a great sponsor for Uber right here. Oh, this one's a pizza. I am here by the parallel parking. He just landed a helicopter on a moving boat. Who wants some pizza? That is crazy. I know you're not supposed to swim after you eat a bunch of pizza, but you are on a $25 million yacht. Which thankfully, when you pay $25 million, you get some jet skis. <gasps> Tariq flipped the jet ski. Yo, Mac, catch this pizza. Oh! 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 It's a $25 million yacht, and I'm the only one enjoying it. <laughs> if you thought this yacht That's was crazy. crazy, look at this video of the $50 million yacht. You know what, <laughs> honestly, let's just go to it right now, zoom in. 
And now we are on the $50 million yacht. This yacht is over 200 feet long, four stories high, can hold over- There's no way Uber actually does that, right? I don't know. I wonder if like it's some super high populated areas, maybe it'd be ridiculously expensive. I don't know. What would be the use case for that? Getting to places that doesn't have roads? I mean, I don't know if they do. It's probably a meme. Like it also kind of wouldn't push me by them. I feel like Uber has like everything. 200 people and comes with a 20 person crew. What this homeless person I found. What's up guys? When you pay $50 million, you're Was given this Davidson? remote that can call the crew at any time. Is that what you call me? No, I just wanted to show how this works. <laughs> but that's not the only thing the remote does. They said this TV goes up and down. That's cool. That is slow, dude. Maybe it's like... <laughs> I'm gonna go downstairs. You guys go upstairs. Tell me if you find anything cool. Okay. okay. Oh, it is massive. It's like a whole nother boat up here. Jimmy, there's nothing cool up here. Don't worry. This is crazy. Whoa. The interesting Wait, thing is, is it just, just me? Is it just me or is Mr. B is Mr. Beast looking bigger? Like, has he been working out? Dude, I feel like um, didn't he and him and Eric like announce on Instagram they were doing like a workout We're challenge? Walking, and I don't know if I'm at the halfway point, the end of the boat, or if I just started. This thing's huge. Meanwhile, Nolan overslept, so he was still trying to find us. Have you seen Mr. Beast? Yes! Are you lying to me? Yes! Apparently Pete Davidson is there. If I don't see Pete Davidson, I'm gonna sink the $50 million yacht. Yeah. Meanwhile, we noticed another boat was approaching us. And then the owner did this. I was waving at him and he showed me his butt. That's gonna be someone's dad one day, dude. <laughs> All right, <laughs> catch. Oh! Where are they going? Are they backing away from us or are we just that much better? <laughs> oh! Get him! Oh! This is the most. Oh! Oh! The guy that's bigger and stronger than all of us did it? <laughs> wow, shocking! I wonder what other kind of food they got on this yacht. I heard they have lamb. They do not have lamb. Mm -hmm. No. This guy's got his own career going, right? This guy right here. I forget what his name is, but he used to be, or he might still be Eric's editor. Cook to the Probably dinner. not anymore. Oh, man. Yeah, Thank you so much. Jesus. It's really good. <laughs> What projects do you have coming up? Uh, oh, I'm very excited. I have a show called Bupkis coming out on Peacock on May 4th. Three days before my birthday. And while Nolan was still trying to find us. Which direction did Mr. Beast go? We noticed a lot of boats surrounding our floating billboard. I didn't even know you could put billboards in the ocean. And we thought they might want some chocolate. I'm delivering chocolate. Yo, you guys want chocolate? Oh my gosh. Best chocolate I've ever had. Let's go. Oh God. Let me know if this is the best chocolate bar ever. Oh my God. Out of 10, to the less, Hershey's don't know nothing. Hershey's <laughs> doesn't know nothing. Everyone agrees it's better than Hershey's. You need to try it. Yeah. Tell oh, me yeah. what you think. Honestly, way better than Reese's. That's what I like to hear. What do you give it? Hey. A 10. I'm flying feastable bars to people. Hey, feastables incoming. Let go of the string! One feastable bar delivered. Hey Carl, they're trying your Damn, gummies. dude. Must be nice to be rich, dude. If you want to try the best chocolate bars, cookies, and gummies now. on the planet, go to Walmart, 7-Eleven, or any Albertson stores right now. Or go to feastables.com right now if you want to order online. Hey, what do you think? This is amazing. This is better than every other chocolate, so why wouldn't you get these nuts? I agree. Put our nuts in your mouth. Oh, all right. <laughs> <laughs> At the end of the day, Nolan finally found us. Jimmy! Nolan! We had another five-star dinner, and the next morning, we boarded Damn. one of the world's largest yachts. This is the $300 million yacht. And it the has over 50 crew members waiting on your every request. Jesus. Tons of luxurious rooms and nine master bedrooms. Oh my God. Welcome aboard. I literally can't see the top of the boat from here. We are the 69th largest yacht in the world. Is that a factual statement? Yes, it is. That is crazy. <laughs> there are six floors, a massive pool, and a hot tub with a view. This is nice. This is ridiculous. This is my favorite boat so far. The $300 million yacht comes with the state-of-the-art gym that Bruh. overlooks the ocean. <laughs> what? Dude, if my boat had a gym, I'd work out. <laughs> A movie theater <laughs> with windows that auto darken whenever you watch something. And even the table Bro. is worth three million dollars. And the piano plays itself. I want one oh, of these creepy. in my house. All the boys disappeared in the spa. Come with me. Oh, you're getting a haircut. Yes. Carl was in the sauna. Are you alive? Barely. That does not look comfortable. And I don't even know where Nolan is. Oh, it's so hot! Man really got in a hot tub it's with a so sunburn. Hot. Dude, there's more downstairs? Whoa. Oh my gosh. Do you think they have enough Jesus. jet skis? What's behind this door? Oh, I'm doing this. One of us 
is getting thrown off the side of the boat. Huh? Mm. <laughs> 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 <Bye>! <laughs> hey, always be ready for nose goes. Jimmy, can we eat some food? Yeah, when you get back. Boys, we must act like rich billionaires. <laughs> Clink. Would you rather have 300 one million dollar ships or one 300 million dollar ship? You could oh, almost have one. one for every different day of the year. I'm not gonna take care of 300 boats. Which would you rather have? 300 boats or one big boat? You want the big boat. Gentlemen, did any of you notice a boat pulling up? No. On that boat might be Tom Brady. By might, I mean it is. And we should probably go say hi to him. Let's go. <laughs> hey, Tom. What's up, guys? And if you what don't know who fuck? Tom Brady is, he is the number one quarterback in NFL history. So this is where you get your hair cut on the boat. So it oh turns gosh. into a dentistry. You clean your teeth, too. You know what's crazy? He could probably buy this. <laughs> is this the nicest boat you've been yeah, on? Yeah, TGK, what's up? It's crazy. If you eat too many of these nuts bars before <laughs> breakfast, I literally had to hide them in my house because I knew these two would sneak to right where yeah. they're at. I did. This place is so fun. It's really an endless maze. I think it's the nicest boat in the world. It's I so really do. beautiful. And it's crazy. We still have more floors to go on. Treats the master of the camera. <laughs> thank you, thank you. This is a way Big. nicer helicopter pad. When I think of a Jesus. helicopter pad on a yacht, this is what I think of. Not what we had before. And with Tom Brady here, of course we had to play some football. This is the most fun version of catch because you just do this and he just throws it there. Nope. <laughs> I just suck. That's what I got paid for, Jimmy. Come on. I want to see if you can hit my drone out of the sky oh, no. with a football. All right. If I hit the drone on the first try, maybe oh. I should come out of retirement. I like that. Dad, you're going to, like, miss. I probably will miss. First try. Oh, oh no shot. Nolan, put your sunscreen on. <laughs> Carl's probably the worst wide receiver you've ever thrown to. Unless you dome him in the head, he's probably not going to catch him. All right, Carl, don't screw this up. Just throw it as far as you can. Oh! 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 You hit him in the chest. You got to hit him in the head. <laughs> After chilling with Tom Brady, we hung out in the movie room for the rest of the night. Would you say this is the best boat so far? 100%. But keep in mind, there's still a billion dollar boat after this. How big can that get? It is four times bigger than this boat. These things get bigger? This ship is bigger than three Statues of Liberty. Holy crap. You cannot fathom how massive this ship is. It is literally a floating city that is 1,200 feet wide and Jesus 17 Christ. stories high. And it fits almost 10,000 people. In all the other ships, we had our own Wait rooms. a minute, bro. That doesn't make any sense, though, because, like... Floating city that is 1,200... 1200 feet wide dude bro my apartment is 1200 square feet so that's not even that big bro you know what i mean like if you do the math in your head that ain't even that feet big wide bro. and 17 stories high and it fits almost 10,000 people in all the other ships we had our own rooms but this ship has over 2,000 rooms this boat has water slides an indoor mall a basketball court and tons of other stuff I can't Jesus. even name. I ran out of fingers. All of which we Jesus have to ourselves. Christ. Have fun, boys. Yes! Yes! The whole. Well, it's that way. Oh, okay. Let's see what yeah. happens. I wonder Whoa. what the sponsor's There's gonna be. There's a water slide. There's a whole entire water park up here. I'm breaking the rules. We're running. We're running. Oh, sorry, my friend. They literally have live music in the water park. What the heck? There's even an entire sports floor that has everything you can imagine. Mini golf. Let's go. We're literally playing mini golf on a oh, ship. Oh my right god. Now. Interference! And I wasn't exaggerating when I said this ship is the a casino. city. There's literally seven Dude. neighborhoods on this ship. This is insane. We're still on a ship. And just for reference, this is what one of those neighborhoods look like. So I went down a slide and now I'm teleported into like a different world. And you have a carousel? They have shops, restaurants, arcades, even a... Bro, how, what do you think the upcharge is? What do you think the upcharge is on a Starbucks on a Starbucks? Like this? Hey Chandler! Hey! A hundred million people are watching. Let's see if you make the shot. He's gonna miss. Knew it. This is crazy. Tom Brady would've made like, that. How can I use all these seats? I'm only one person. And apparently there's an entire floor for indoor shows and events. What is this, bro? We got the whole bro. ship to ourselves, so. How much, like, do you ever think about the logistics of all the power that it takes to power something like this? Like, think about it. Think about the fuel that this thing's got to have, the electricity to power everything. So, so. Obviously, I don't need this giant ship all to myself. So I wanted to share this experience with you guys, my subscribers. I love Mr. B. Subscribe to Mr. B. Holy cow, this boat. Actually pretty nice. What's up, boys? Let's get it. We're going to go ride the carousel. Think about how much it's polluting the sea. Where can we go? Mario Kart, dude. 
And just when we had thought we had seen everything here, what is this? How do humans build this stuff? Also in this giant mall, inside of this giant ship, there's a bar that comes down from the ceiling. Wait, what are those robotic arms? That's our bionic bar. All right, buddy. Oh, oh. <laughs> From the kids' menu. See how much you guys, my subscribers, were enjoying this ship. Never let go. Never let go. And I had one last surprise for my subscribers on the cruise ship, so I had Nolan gather them all together. I have a big announcement for all of you. To all the subscribers we brought here today, we're giving you a three-night free cruise. Here it is. And if you want to be in a video in the future, subscribe so you can join us next time. We filmed a secret Mr. Beast video that will never be uploaded to YouTube. The only way you can watch this video is by buying a Feastables product within the next 30 days and scanning the QR code on the back of it. There's literally never been a better time to buy Feastables from Walmart, Albertsons, 7-Eleven, or Feastables.com. I spent over a million dollars on this secret video. You want to buy Feastables so you can watch it. Damn, dude. His videos are getting like substantially better. Like I kind of felt like a month ago watching Mr. Beast content, there was like a bit of a plateau that was being reached where it was like with the editing or the storytelling or whatever. His last two uploads specifically, I don't know if he's changed like editing teams or something, but this something has one. significantly changed. Like um, from the de everything from the death video on has felt different. There's been something different about these last three uploads. Can't quite put my finger on it, but they've been measurably better. And that's coming from somebody that consumes a lot of YouTube content. Yeah, this is apparently like already on track to break like crazy records. This is already doing better than Squid Game. Apparently, I saw a tweet about it earlier. Has he changed the title or thumbnail at all? He has not. This is always so fun to check though. Has he changed the title or thumbnail for this at all? No. I think he changed this one a ton though, didn't he? Or no, he just changed it twice. Look at that. All he did was lighten the skin on his face. That's literally all he did. That's ridiculous, man.